Good afternoon, everybody. This is Topic City 402. This is part 3. Let's play The Legend of Zelda the Minish Cap. That's when I left off. We started the first dungeon already. And we just killed the mini boss. And the point being, this dungeon right here is because we have to uh, find our first element, the earth element. So, to pick that uh, that item we just picked up from the mini boss, hit start, hit L, and select the uh, gush jar, hit A. And what this bad boy can do with you hold A and um see the gust door is a vacuum cleaner. It's just vacuum up the spider web from the door. Yeah, like that. Now first thing we want to do we want to head down for the heart piece. You got a heart piece. So we collect one more to increase your life energy. Yep, yeah, so keep that in mind, folks. And also you can also vacuum up dirt with it. Yes, yeah, so keep that in mind because we'll be doing this a lot in this dungeon. Anyway, I just got I just got done doing a practice for my uh on my first spot and I'm I'm fucking stuck. Because I see my Skype title, I'm trying to go for the second element, but um I go to Hyrule Town, I head west, and there's this fucking dog blocking my path, and I don't know what to do to um uh, to get past that dog that's blocking my path. So if anybody know, cause can somebody please tell me what to do? Or probably in this episode, I'll probably, I'll probably show where I'm stuck at. Okay, it's a good thing we stuck in that button because that port, that uh, that portal is a portal. We're gonna go for that uh, for that heart piece up there. Yup. That's gonna be our, that's gonna be our last uh, heart piece. All right. Yeah, you can kill these guys. Oh yeah, that's why you can uh, back these base up and uh, throw it at them. I didn't freaking know that. Alright. Alright. So stopping that button again. Alright. And that should reveal the ten mysterious shells. Well, I don't know what the shells do. If somebody knows what the shells do, please do tell in the comments. Because I would like to know. Well, I understand I'm not going for 100%, but still. And we got another ten mysterious shells, which I don't know about. Alright, what's down? Oh, if I go down, then the whole thing's gonna respawn. Now, this is how you're supposed to kill these mushroom dudes. You backing them up, then hit them with your sword. Alright, oh god damn, I was walking right into the motherfuckers. What you guys been up to? Today is November the uh, 28th, right? Let me see. Yep, today's the 28th. Just a few more days till December. Three more days till December, I mean. Let's see what's to the right. Ah, right, yeah, you want yeah, you want to vacuum all these dust up to look for these switch. And that's another mysterious shell. You got twenty of them. All right. Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, I know that room up there. Take him out. Ah, dick. So he took two hits. Well, apparently he doesn't. Am I going the right way this time? I hope I am. Oh, I gotta pick it up and throw it. Okay, we got another heart piece out of that. I mean, uh, heart health out of that. Yeah, I think we're supposed to head. Oh, god damn it! Hey, you can't do that. That's against the rules. Alright, stacking these guys up. Just taking the fuck out. Alright, now you may die in the furno. Wait, just get that ruby just for the hell of it. And we head down. Alright, this is where we're supposed to go. Now I remember. And you wanna back in the uh that web up. And let's see what's down there. Oh wait, 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 wait. See if I head down then um I'm gonna fall in that fucking that fucking water. Alright, let's just keep on running, 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 running. Hmm. Am I not going the right way? Cause now I rem I don't remember now. I should cause I did this last night. Oh yeah, we've been here before. Well, let's go back in the barrel and spin around. 
Alright. Oh no, no, no! Are you sure? Are you sure that's where I'm heading? See, that's because if, if I step over there, I'm going to fall down here. Huh. Oh, yeah, I am supposed to go down there. Oh, my God, I forgot. Now you want to use your vacuum and pull that leaf to you. Then jump on it. Now what? Unless we find a way to travel by water, we won't be able to go much farther. I cannot believe I forgot about this. Because I forgot, I, I just got finished with this dungeon last night. How can I forget something like that? Alright. Oh god, I thought, I thought I was gonna fall in that fucking water. See, the only thing I don't like about this part is that I don't know why the freaking, um, the lily pad's not going as I, uh, use the vacuum cleaner. It's kinda hard to. Oh god damn it. Oh come on, man, hit the motherfucker. It's kind of hard to explain it, but the lily pad doesn't move until I uh, let go of the A button. I mean, I, I don't understand that logic game. I really don't. I understand that the I understand it's like sucking, but uh, still, it would still give me a fucking boost, but it doesn't give you boost until you until Link shoots the uh, vacuum cleaner. That's what's giving him the boost. All right, so now we get, we gotta get on land first to push the base on that switch to get the gate open. All right, come on. Man, this is so fucking slow. All right, now let's walk up the stairs. Oh, really? I right, pick up the base. Leave one alive. Push this face in, and uh, let's on that switch. Now let me go look for some hearts. All right, there's one. All right, we're at full health now. No! Didn't want to do that. For a second, I thought it was gonna send me back all the way back to the fucking beginning of this uh, of this section. But we still got a fence. We want to get the small key. Cause yeah, cause yeah, guys. If I took that other path, there's gonna be a locked door. We have to come through this area first to get the small key. I don't have the fucking patience. Alright, now here's that particular room I was talking about in my last video. Alright. Now let's get on land. Oh, wait, 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 First, I took that view to fuck out, and he still hit me. Damn it! And I'm about to sneeze. Hold on. <coughs> All right. God bless me. And this is why you want that face set on that uh, set on that switch because we came here, and you didn't put that that face on the switch, and you like basically you like basically fucked. Well, not quite because you, you just got to do a little bad trick. No, no, not necessarily because. You, you could have waited till later, for instance. Yeah. Yeah, you, yeah, you, you could have came here later and, and deal with it. So basically, you want you want to fuck yourself over. So I was wrong. I just wasn't thinking. Cause you know me in Zelda games, I go loopy minded. Just like I am with my first file because I'm kind of stuck. So we only got nine minutes in the video, so hopefully at the end of this video, I'll show you, I'll show you what, I'm got, what I'm talking about. And I kind of hate how the game like throw you off a little bit, cause you don't think that you're, you're like fucked. But thank goodness you put that face on that switch, otherwise there is no way to make progress. All right, now we're going to the other direction I was that I mentioned, and you should see a locked door. Oh, oh my God, flying slugs! God damn it. I hate I hate enemies that comes out of the fucking ceiling and out of nowhere. Alright, there's that locked door I was talking about. Now that should okay, yeah. The boss key should be in this should be in this room. Alright, that's pull, pull, pull. Alright. Let's 
pick up the vase and throw it. Oh god damn, why would you roll in the fucking water, you dumbass? Then you wanna use the vacuum cleaner to suck that mushroom in. Wow, that's kinda clever. The game is really, really clever, this physics. I give them credit. Alright. Anything in the vase I should know about? Oh wait, don't forget about that portal if you want to get that, um, get that heart container. And that should give us the boss key. Use the open big doors. And everybody knows that when you use a boss key, you unlock a boss door. And it's a good thing we had to break that blue portal because it should take us to the, uh, the heart piece. You collect the heart piece, you put a new heart container. Alright. Now we got four heart containers. Four heart. We got four heart bars. Now this is where the game kind of threw me off. Now this is, this is where the uh, ball store is at. Well, I believe I believe I showed you guys my last video. But uh, we want to go. We want to go to the room on the left for the uh, twenty rupees. All right. Push this rock. Open up to the twenty rupees. Can I push the rock again? Nope. Yeah, I, of course, I go. I gotta go on the other side, right? Wait, let me go back down. Let me go back down. Oh, no, can I push that rock over there? Nope. Nope. And nope. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta go to the other side. Of course they would do that. Do, 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 do. And down I go. Even though look at the stairs is going up. Wait a minute. Where we at? Oh yeah, because we are going up because we're in the first floor. Alright, let's pull that fucking dick. Then we go south from here. Pull the mushroom, suck the mushroom. And... Enter the boss door. Now this boss fight is pretty easy. And wow, it appears that we got to the boss room before that little slime dude has. So I don't, I don't know that fucker's name, so if somebody knows his name, please do tell in the comments. And of course, the first boss of the Stellar series are always easy. So we fight Sabo with Slime again from Yoshi's Island? I don't think so. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is you want to use the back of cleaner to suck his uh, legs in. Oh god, oh shit. But watch out when he jumps though. It's hard to fucking turn him around at times. Let's keep on doing that until he uh, tips over. Alright, now he's gonna tip over. Now watch out. Watch out for his big ass head. Oh god. And keep on slashing his head like it's no freaking tomorrow. So now he's gonna like jump on you. But be careful. Try not to use the vacuum cleaner where he jump because when you do that, it's gonna be hard for you to move out of his way when he tries to jump on you. Because he, cause Link slows down when he uses the vacuum cleaner. Alright. Just gotta dodge when he try to fall on you. Uh. Come on, you can fall now. Thank you. Alright, one more hit will do. This is not that bad. Now he's gonna jump like, like three times. Oh, uh, come on, come on. Shit. Uh, okay, got him. Man, you got a big ass head. God damn, you his you hit as big as a hot air balloon. All right, now the boss is dead. Now get out of my sight and die. Ha ha ha. And you know you know the routine when it comes to starter games. We get we get a uh, we get a special requirement like the uh, element like the earth element for example. Then we should get then we should get an extra heart container. We got the earth element, the powder earth. If if you guys want to go for a three heart challenge, then be my guest. But let's get a free heart container. Yeah, every time you beat a boss, you get a free heart container. It's just like all the Zelda games. It ain't nothing new. Ah, you got the Earth Element. You must go tell the Elder at once. Alright. 
So now we go, now we go talk, talk to the Elder. Alright, since we got time, now I can finally show you where, where I'm stuck at. On my first file. Alright, now, now we go talk to the Elder. And he should give us our next destination. Oh, yeah, so he, he, oh, we can pick up bombs now, but uh, we'll, we'll pick up bombs in a few minutes. You found the Earth Element. You are blessed with much courage and strength for one so young. If your conviction holds strong, head to Mount Corano. And where the fuck is that at? If somebody know where that's at, please do say in the comments. Then you find a man named Mar Marlari. Among the minutes, there is no more able to carry your sword. If you ask him, I am certain he will before your broken parkour blade. I shall send you him. I shall send word to him in advance. Terror safety, you are brave, but there are many evils in the new world. He looks like a chicken. He got a chicken tail. Leave through the door here. It will take you out of the forest quickly. Great elder, we are on your dub. We should head for Mount Carreno at once. Alright. So I don't know where Mount Carreno is, so if somebody knows, please do tell in the comments so I can get this LP done in no time. Alright, now we're gonna make us so big. Wait, wait, before we do that, let's go in the house and get some bombs. Green clothes and mysterious hat. Sir, would you be late by any chance? The one who found the uh, Earth element? Show you are, I have heard so many tales about you. I am Berlari, the searcher of the acquaintance. I am also well vivid. In inventory, you know, you won't be able to get back to town due to the debris. Here, I have something that might come in handy. And we got some bombs. It has 10 bombs in it. Bombs, you want them? It's yours, my friend. As long as you have enough rubies. Alright, now we stand next to the stump. Hit R to grow up. And now we get the hell out of here. Alright. Now we gotta talk to these gravestones and blow it up. And I don't know what the uh, gravestones do. If somebody knows, please do, please do tell me. This game is semi-blind, which means that we'll ask for help from stuck. And I don't want any criticizing. Alright, now we can select our bombs. By going to items, hit A. And type A to place a bomb on the rocks. And blue splash. Do, 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 do. All right. I just use the mushroom and blast with the other side. Wee! All right. Well, there's nothing we can do in this house because he's gonna give you some bullshit information. All right. Let's see what's in the wall over here. And and we go. All right. Twenty mysterious shells. And hello, bats. So now I get to show you where I'm stuck at. But first, before I do that, we're gonna learn. We're gonna learn a new move. All right. Now we're in the South Hyrule field, like from the beginning of the game. Do do. And now we're going back to the uh, to the Hyrule town, and we should get a cutscene. Come on, come on, see how many kinstone pieces you can collect. You never know what focusing kinstones will do, but it should be good. Come on, once you get your free kinstone bag for holding your keystone pieces, don't miss out on this incredible once in a lifetime opportunity. Yes, you're, in, you're here for your free keystone bag, aren't you? That's right, maybe you didn't hear me, but they're free from all the kids right now. You got a keystone bag. You can now carry keystone pieces with you. Press start. The viewers contact me. Okay. Fitting two keystone pieces together is called a keystone fusion. If you get two pieces to fit perfectly, great habits will come your way. I'll put a keystone piece in your keystone bag so you can give it a try. So you're ready and willing to fuse keystones will look like I could do right now. When you see that look, look in their eyes, that's when you press L. Use the D pad to use the keystone pieces. Press A to Try fusing it. Did you catch all that? Yes. Then stand in front of me and press L so we can uh, fuse keystones. Yes, that's right. Press L. Okay, I did press L. And you want to hit A and 
the two keystone pieces work perfectly, then something good will happen. Alright, we had a 20 minute mark, holy shit. And oh my god, we've seen that place before. And if we go there, that's gonna give us a, a, a heart piece. Alright, that's in the South Hyrule field. That means we're. Okay. Sorry, I didn't read that because I had to do it by accident. Alright, now you wanna go south. You wanna follow the path. Alright. Just follow the dirt path till you see the, uh. See that tree with that thorn on it. Well, it's no. It's no oh, shit! Freaking text messages. God damn it. Oh shit. Well guys, I gotta go to the store. Hold on for me, I'll be right back. Alright guys, I'm back. Well, I had to, I had to talk to my mom because... Well, because in a few minutes, after I stop my video, I'm gonna go to the store for my mom and get some cat food. And we got a piece of hearts. Alright. You know what, I, I, I guess I can make this episode a little longer because, like I said, this is new skill I want to learn, and oh my goodness. And if you, if you guys don't know, this is Link's house. Yup, Link's house from the beginning of the game, but enough about that, let's go, um, let's go learn this new, let's go learn this new skill. Then I get to show you where I'm stuck on, so you guys can help me. Alright, now. Let's see, now I gotta find this particular house. Yep, there it is. This is the one. Hopefully this won't take long. I am Swift Blade, the final swordsman in all in all Hyrule. If you train with me, I'll guarantee that you will increase the, you will increase your skill dramatically. So would you like to train here? Yes. We shall start with the most basic of all techniques. I shall teach you the spin attack. Yep, you guys know it's been a tech from a link to the past, uh, Skyward Store, I can read time and such. Alright. I'll do, I'll do the instruction. You hold the, you hold the B button and just let go. It's a simple. So I don't feel like reading all this. This is quite obvious how to do the spin, how to do the spin attack. Alright, you hit B, then hold and then release and do the spin attack. Like you, just like you did on a, a link to the past. All right, just hold it, then let go, cause you'll be doing this a lot. Yes, fine, Rook. You're a quick study. I will give you this tiger scroll. If you ever forget this technique, you can view in this scroll. What I'm not gonna do. All right, now I get to show you where I'm stuck before I stop the video. All right, so we head upwards. And this is why I'm talking about my Skype title. Apparently, I can't cross this bridge right here. But, I can actually cross the other bridge. Right, let's go up, up, up. Wait, wait, wait. We want to go up the stairs, then go to the left. See, because the bird said that if we go west, we should find the next element. Well, I mean the hat, rather. Don't tell me if something's wrong with you. Diminished because you murdered Mark and Ever. How are we supposed to go to... Okay. And this is why I'm stuck yet. I'm trying to get past this fucking dog here. Let's speak to him. All he says is, Arf, arf, arf. But I can't seem to do nothing about it, so. I try walking past him. The game's not letting me. I try speaking to him, but he's not moving out. He's not moving, out, he's not moving the fuck out the way. So, uh, does anybody know what I'm supposed to do to get past this dog? If so, please do tell. Oh, there's nothing I need help on. I believe it's in the shoe room. Alright, I'll probably go to the shoe room. If I can find it. I think I think it's south. Yeah, it's right here. Alright, so I went to the shoe shop. I jump in the face. So I can shrink. Oh yeah, get used to it because you gonna watch this every time. I wish they give you the option to skip it, but no, they make you watch it. Alright, that's right. Even some human objects are pearls to the Minish world. Those Minish may not look like, but they are quite crafty. 
Alright, let's go up the stairs. And for some reason, I can't get I can't get by those shoes. So if somebody know how to get past those shoes, can somebody tell me what I'm, what I'm supposed to do here? Because I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Alright, let's go find a different ending spot. So I guess I can't do anything just yet. Alright, we're at 25 minute mark. Oh my god, this video is going way too long. But I'm gonna make but I'm gonna but I'm gonna get to that to that fucking dog. Now as you guys again, let's cross the bridge. Then head south. And again, what do I have to do to get past this dog right here? If somebody knows, please tell me out here because I like to know. Alright guys, so next time on part next time on next episode of Let's Play the Lesson of Southern Minish Cap, we're gonna see how the fuck we'll get past that fucking dog. So until next time, something's 842 out.